Yo, what's up, everyone? It's the Dark Horse here, and we're jumping in with our Vampire 2.0 deck. Obviously, hopefully, achieving a victory. We've lost one already. It's basically a win loss, win loss battle. If I can get to gold two, well, I don't know. We're just going to play. Hopefully, I, I don't want to demote. I want to even if it's a win loss, win loss, win loss, win loss thing, it's fine. You know, I just I cannot afford to demote. But yeah, obviously, I don't mind losing the coin toss because it makes things easier. Because obviously, I've seen us play well with vampires on a first turn basis. But then, I don't know how well it plays out on a second turn basis. But we'll see. The only thing that makes me anxious about going first is the fact that things can hit the fan very quickly. This is actually pretty good. I could actually do some pretty good setup here. Activate Jack of Bolan. Uh, discard. Set. Activate Vampire Domain. This is the one we have to discard from the hand, isn't it? I oh, know. Okay. Activate Zombie World. Hmm. Right. Do I activate that? I think I should, because it gives me a spur. Oh, Vampire Monster. But the thing is... What's Jack of Bolan? During your opponent, you can tag one zombie monster and either go for some that monster, then banish his face card until the end phase. Yeah. Oh, but I need to tribute. Um... Is there a way... Technically, I haven't normal summoned yet. So let me go familiar. I'll send you to the graveyard. Special summon familiar. Activate familiar's effect. Allow me to add a monster. Which... Because normally I'd go for grace, but then... I haven't normal summoned yet, so... Okay. I haven't normal summoned yet, so what I could do is normal summon here. Special summon. I would go Vampire Sucker. Actually, go Verte. Go Familiar and Retainer. <laughs> Verte. Activate. A2000. Fusion Destiny. DPE. Dasher. Denier. Defense Mode. <clears throat> and then... I'll end my turn there. Because the way I view it, I can activate Jack of Bolan. Oh... Wait, can I target a monster in the opponent's graveyard? I can. Oh, great. I have no... No protection. This is what I hate about going first. Uh, nope. Fair play. Annoying, but fair play. Hmm. Okay. Mate, if this is Despia again, I swear to... God. It is going to be, isn't it? It definitely is. <laughs> this is why I hate ranked. I have got to a point where I physically hate playing ranked now. I really do. Um... No. I'm just trying to think. Hmm. Oh, you motherfucker. Ah. <sighs> uh. Should have seen it coming. I have no idea why I didn't question it. 
Now he gets the freaking pick up as well. Add one fright. For... <sighs> no wonder this freaking guy is promoted and ready to promote. Like, why, why couldn't he just play against someone else and just disappear and spin to the higher ranks? Why did I have to be his victim? No point. It's annoying because obviously I could have obviously activated this card's effect special summon and add a but it would have made no difference. Doesn't matter what I pull, I am not gonna be able to counter this deck. We've managed to deal with it once, but I fucking hate playing Master Duel now, man. You know what? That's a lie. I enjoy playing Master Duel. I'm just tired of seeing nothing happens. Every single season gets restarted. And there's a ban list for three cards. You know? And there's always going to be that one deck that just gets used and abused. And the thing is, it's not, it's not the decks. It's not the game. It's nothing. It's Konami itself that drives me insane. They put out a bloody update feature thing going we will provide the essential updates to make sure that this game is a lot more enjoyable and fun for the people playing it and then in the small text it says only if you run better i know they have casual mode we have been playing that it's been nice but at the same time it's just it's the drive you know what i mean but yeah I'm only sticking in this because I want the challenge. That's it. Yo, okay. First off, we talk about packs. Yeah, we pull very good cards. I think Konami listens in. Do you... Obviously, this sounds absolutely barbaric and insane. How the hell does that happen? I think Konami are doing something. Because honestly, if I play against this guy again... I will not be happy, Konami. You understand what I'm saying? Huh? Oh shit, I just minimise that. I don't want to minimise that. I want to go back. I am not going to do all this dude again. I bet he's raging. I personally would be too. What is this deck? This is the... Uh... Oh, that was that guy's uh, thingamajig deck, weren't it? I don't know why I've kept it, to be honest. Ah, oh, you know what, I'll keep it. Um, vampire. Do, do, do. Change accessories. Let's go with... Oh, no, we've got to give it some style. Let's go with this, and then let's go with the... We'll go with the shadow style card, and then the dark ritual cage, and then... Yeah. And we'll go with that one. And then three main cards. Not that any of this matters, but yeah. Okay, we will go Shadow Vampire because it's essential. Scrooge. Scrouge. Yeah, we'll go with that. I was gonna go Beatrice, but then I was just thinking, nah, 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 it's cool. Alright, this is this is it. Let's do this. What is the challenges I need to complete anyway? This is what I'm working for. Oh, okay, so that duel didn't, because I didn't, oh, that's stupid, man. You have to click on it for it to, get the fuck out. All right, let's do this. It's time! Could he be running Spiral? That's the question. Find out in the next episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel. This is one feature that I don't like as well. I know, obviously, it does make sense to why they do it, where level 3, rank 3, rank 3, obviously, both parts, cool. But yeah, I love that green sleeve. I've got, I know I've got the green. I swear to God, if this is Eldritch, mate, this game is driving me up the freaking wall. Wow, it is as well. Great. Don't you just love Yu-Gi-Oh?
Oh, we activate foolish barrier. Drop ten card. I send. Uh... Well, to be fair, they're zombies anyway, aren't they? So. Ooh. If I go Vampire Grace, then that way if I special summon. I don't know, because I could get the effect. Wait, 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 wait. Familiar? Familiar? Normal summon retainer. Activate familiar. Vampire Desire. That's your deck. You're going to have Solomon Strike, aren't you? Or Judgment. We'll see. What is this deck? Thing is, I can't destroy it anyway. What special summon denier? That's by denier. You're gonna have another one, aren't you? No. I got a feeling there could be magic cylinders, you know. Oh no, weirdly I think there could be. Or it's a mirror force. <laughs> okay. And my turn now. is outrageous this is the deck this guy's grinding with i haven't seen eat this combo in like seven years i'm in trouble if we've got another banquet mate we're dead there is no way you've got a third one any monsters in the graveyard? No, it's just relying on pure traps. Unbelievable. It's fine. If I go Phoenix, maybe. We'll see. I'm going to go Shadow Vampire. Which then the effect in the graveyard will activate, allowing me to normal summon. Actually, I don't need to. Yeah, 
tribute. Bring out. Activate effect. This is a tough one. Vampire retainer. Send you to the graveyard. No. Thing is, I can't destroy him. This is where it becomes a problem. I could end up going into vampires. Nah. Wait, hold up. He says he. Screw it. Proceed to the battle phase. Oh, I can't attack. Oh, I'm so stupid. In the turn. Thank you. Another face down. Okay. I might have to hide a happy feather duster in her. Actually, I have a play. I have an idea. Special summon. Into Phoenix. One and two. Phoenix comes out. Activate Phoenix. Decide glow. Destroy. Activate the effect. Necro World Banshee. Resolve. Zombie world. Ah. Huh. I had a feeling you'd be running fucking magic cylinder. You're trying to go for the magic cylinder combo. Magic cylinders. Sorry, should I say. Bala comes to the field. Do we go for that play? Let's go for it. Yes. Fascinator. Activate effect. Thank you. Wait, do I have to banish a monster? Yeah. Nope. Special summon. Special summon. Oh, I'd have to go with these two. Would it be worth it?
Do I? Fuck it. Let's do it. Alec can then go to the graveyard and then join the next standby face if there is one. Ha oh, ha, special summon a monster. Nice. Proceed to the battle phase. We'll start with low first. See if there's anything there. There is something there. Three, wait, three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. It's at eighteen hundred. Yeah, that's fine. Zombie. Magic cylinder. No. What was it then? Okay. Nice. What did we have? He must have had a banquet. Or he had, yeah. No, no, actually, no, he could have had to play Ring of Destruction still anyway. But it wouldn't have been DD Dynamite. It wouldn't have been, I don't know what it was then. I don't know. Unless it was just, no, he couldn't have been, he would have had to play it. Unless it was this. Most special summons wants uh when the extra and you do not choose four number XEs, which he's running the um No he's not. Wait what? Yeah he is. Yeah, numerons. Interesting. Okay. One for promotion. Hopefully we can do it in this episode. Here we go. Ayazora, guide me the way. Let me go second. With my glass of water. Stay hydrated and keep your teeth healthy. Unlike me. I'm a grinder on my teeth, that's the problem. But yeah. Hmm. Okay. This is, uh. Okay. Not bad. What do we have? End phase. That's evenly matched. 100% that's evenly matched. Easily. That is 100% evenly matched. Alright. Family. Vampire desire. Target one. Increased level. No. Activate effect in graveyard. This guy really thinks I'm going to walk in. Yes, send that to the graveyard. He'll be forced to activate. I, I definitely, any time someone sets up with one card, it's definitely evenly matched. Do not play it yet. We wait. A2000. Send Fusion Destiny. No. Special Summon. Dasher. Denier. Fence Mode. Evenly matched. Evenly matched. Evenly matched. not 
Let's cross out. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. Those are good. Battle phase. Oh wait, we can't attack anyway. Do oh no, we can. Yeah. Can have it. Right, we're good. We're good. We're getting better. We're getting better, ladies and gentlemen. We're getting better. We're we're getting close. Match history. Azura. Confirm opponent's deck. Interesting as a mach running machiner. He put the one card that he only runs one of. Unless he was holding out for Nibiru. Maybe. Okay, I'm happy with that. I am happy. I'm debating whether to... Or not. Okay. We'll play one more. Play one more. I think tonight might be the night that actually goes well for us. We'll see. Right, hopefully we go second. I seem to be okay against every deck but Despia. Despia, Marincess, uh, what's it called? Can't remember its name. Okay, this is uh, this is interesting because I need to activate Max C here. It's got cool. Oh, it's got ash. Okay. That's fine. That's better. That's better. You know what I mean? Okay. <sighs> then you link into Boot Sector or whatever the bloody hell it's called. Strike a dragon into boot sector and add a card. Tribute and add. Basically the same play as always. Um, I'm trying to think what deck was running this. The only thing is, I think that a lot of the time there is a specific play that goes into Borrow Load Savage. I have to kind of work out whether I can counter that play or it's fine because as long as we stay in the rank we're in, I'm happy. You know what I mean? Yeah, okay, so it always goes into Savage and Savage would obviously target uh, Striker. Which is fine. Which the only downfall to it is when a component's card of effect activates, you can move from borrow account and negate the effect. So this is not looking good. In all honesty. Um I will have to go with this play. Oh, it's just... Ash Blossom, mate. The card he picked up 
is the card that countered me. Absolute madness. We know he's going to get negated. But the problem is if I go to Naya. Right, let's go with this. I need him to negate. I need him to negate. Oh, you got to be kidding me! How are you picking this up? You got to be fucking kidding me! Come on, mate, you got fucking mate, you make a choice. It's not hard. Just trying to think. <laughs> Let's go Verte. Oh no, he went hot red. For some reason I thought, oh, okay. I have to, I have to activate it. Madness, man. Not yet.
Mm -mm. Oh, I should put it in attack mode, idiot. I might be fortunate enough to enough to get a playoff. Maybe. We'll see. Hold up. When the summons been... This card is in the grave of trouble. Let's play you discover and destruction special on this card. Oh, and then you go into a synchro. What are you going into? Buster Dragon. Basically turns every monster into freaking dragons now. actually screws me over. I think that's how we play it. Fucking hell, man. How many effects do you activate in the grave? Wow. That's mad. Just when I thought, oh, okay, I'm doing okay. This guy's coming out summoning 700 freaking monsters. Okay. That's that play you're going for. I need to figure out on how I'm going to do this. Oh, prosperity. <sighs> Tough crowd. I'm going to banish six. Um... Can't even. Don't need you. Two. Three. Four. Shit. Five, six. Technically, you can still activate your effect, can't you? Whoa. That's any card. Shit. Didn't see that coming. <laughs> I'm dead. I actually can't do anything. Well played. Well played. Oh. How annoying, Peterson. Okay. Well played. I'll give you that. It's nice to see different style of decks, you know. But fair play. It's been a while since I've seen Buster Blader, so I can't complain. Thank you guys for watching. It's been a pleasure. Take care of yourselves. Peace. Ah!